Have you ever wondered what bots you should add to your server? Well, here are the top five bots you must have. Note that all the website links mentioned in this video are in the description. First up is Sapphire. Sapphire is one of the best multi-purpose bots on Discord. It is fully customizable and completely free. Their website provides an overview of the bot's features. You can add the bot to your server like this. After adding the bot, head to the dashboard like this. I won't be going through every feature the bot offers, as I'll be making some separate videos regarding this bot in the future. But I will go through the important ones. To add manager roles, go to general settings and add the roles like this. Select roles that don't have administrator, as administrator roles will be added by default. We won't be looking into the moderation features because I will be showing a better bot for that next. One feature this bot offers is social media notifications. They will be posted directly to your server through the bot. It does YouTube, Twitch, and TikTok notifications as well. Join roles are roles that will be added for every user when joining the server. Reaction roles can also be done using this bot. A deep dive into this feature will be in a future video. Welcome messages is also a great feature offered by the bot. Join messages, leave messages, boost messages, as well as role assignment messages. Role connections is also an amazing feature. It assigns and or removes roles when certain conditions are met. This bot can also log all the actions happening on your server. You can control each category individually or set a channel for all the types. As I said earlier, an upcoming video is dedicated to exploring this bot further. So make sure to subscribe if you want to be notified. The next bot is Wic. Wic is the best moderation and security bot you can have on your server. You can visit the bot's official website to see what the bot has to offer. Its auto moderation system is one of the best out there. The bot also consists of features such as an anti-nuke system and verification. Some other features are listed at the bottom of the page. You can add the bot to your server like this. After adding, you will be redirected to the dashboard. In this video, I will only be discussing the auto moderation feature. The specialty of the auto moderation system of this bot is that it runs on a heat system. You will understand what that is in a bit. Go to filters and select a module. I'll select anti-spam. Here, when you increase the heat, it will trigger the action easily. For example, when I increase this, the number of messages required to trigger the action decreases. You can select your trigger action by clicking on the drop-down menu. The action duration can be adjusted in this manner. Everything I demonstrated here applies to every auto-moderation module of the bot. If you need a separate video regarding this bot where I am going to explain each and every feature comprehensively, do comment down below. The third bot is Arcane. Arcane is a multi-purpose bot that mainly focuses on leveling. It is a way of ranking the members in your server based on their contribution to the server. When members send messages, it earns them XP. The higher the XP, the higher the ranking. They can also earn roles according to their rank. I have a separate video regarding how to set up a leveling system using Arcane, so make sure to watch it after this video. You can also check the server leaderboard by simply running a command. The fourth bot we will be discussing is Ticket Tool. This bot is a must-have if you're running a server with a considerable amount of members. It enables members to contact staff when they need support. If you need help setting up this bot, I also have another video regarding that. Make sure to check it out after this video. This bot called Tickets can be used as an alternative if you want. So I'll link that bot's website in the description as well. Last but not least is Geek Music. It is one of the best music bots on Discord currently. You can use Discord's application directory to add the bot. After adding, Run the slash help command to see all the music commands available. The main command is play. 
After you type the command, you can either send the song name or attach the song as a file. If you select music, you have to enter the song name or its link. This bot supports SoundCloud, Spotify, YouTube, and some others. Make sure to join a voice channel before running the command. After running it, the bot will start playing the music like this. These are the options you get. You can add multiple songs to the queue by running the play command repeatedly. You can view the queue by clicking here. All the other options are pretty self-explanatory. So, those are the top 5 bots to add to your server. If you want to check out more bots, click on the playlist on the screen right now. I'll see you next time.